Hi friends, what's up? This is RK from 360 Reader. Right now, I'm going to show how to see your purchase history on iPhone and iPad. Want to see the history of purchases you have made with your Apple account? Maybe your credit card got charged by Apple for an unauthorized transaction. Perhaps one of your family members purchased an app without your knowledge. Thankfully, you can check your purchase history from your iPhone and iPad and click all of your doubts. That all being said, let's learn how to view your purchase history on iPhone and iPad with ease. Before getting started, make sure you have subscribed our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 Reader. It's worth pointing out that your purchase history includes a list of all transactions made on the App Store, iTunes Store, Apple Books, and the Apple TV app. This also includes subscriptions to services like iCloud, Apple Music, EDC. This allows you to check all your transactions and make sure they are accurate. Plus, if you have multiple payment methods linked to your Apple account, you can even see which credit card was used to purchase an item. To get going, open the settings app on your iPhone or iPad. After that, tap on the Apple ID banner located at the top center. Here, tap on Media and Purchases located right below the iCloud option. Now, scroll down and tap on Purchase History located just below Subscriptions. By default, all the purchases that you have made in the last 90 days are shown here. However, you can access your older transactions too. Simply tap on last 90 days to filter search. Next up, you have the option to select the year the transaction was made, followed by which you will be able to further filter the search by the respective month. Pretty easy and straightforward, right? So that's the way you can view your purchase history on your iPhone and iPad. From now on, you don't have to start panicking when you see a credit card charge from Apple that you are not sure of. The purchase could be a paid app download, an in-app transaction, or even a monthly subscription fee that most people don't keep a track of. It's worth noting that free app downloads will show up in your purchase history too. That's pretty much it. So that's the way you can view your purchase history on your iPhone and iPad. If you have found this video helpful, make sure to like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy iPhone and iPad hacks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye-bye.